Greetings from Nature Unseen 360. Welcome to the channel. I request humbly before going into the details. Please subscribe and click on the bell icon that you won't miss an update in future. According to Guinness Book, Honey Badger is acknowledged as the world's most fearless creature based on its behaviors. Amazing but true. And it attacks beehives for honey, feeds on deadly snakes and porcupines, steal cheetahs' cubs, and they will dare to snatch food from hungry lions. In fact, their unique skin offers honey badger at most protection against dogs, arrows, spears, and machetes, even. However, Honey badgers are small, but not afraid to take on large animals such lions, hyenas. That's why honey badgers are often called the fiercest animal on the planet. In addition to being incredibly fierce, aggressive, and grumpy, honey badgers are super smart because they have large brain for their body size. They are one of the few non-primate species to use tools. Honey badgers get their name from their fondness for feeding on honey and honeybee larva. They are mean, always on the lookout to pick a fight. They will easily take on a porcupine, lion or even snake. They don't always win but they have definitely earn respect out here in the wild. They have sharp and strong teeth. They can break through a tortoise shell and even the metal locks on our bins. And also, if they feel threatened, they can release a stink bomb which contains a stinky liquid on their tail. These strong Ferocious, clever animals are also found in the Middle East and India. They have a thick skin. In fact, it is the same thickness as a buffalo's skin which is 50 times heavier than a honey badger. Their skin is rubbery and like a set of loose clothing which allows them to move around in a brilliant form of self-defense. They are born blind and hairless. When they come into this world, they are completely dependent on their mom who carries them around in their mouth. Although their hair starts to grow in a couple of weeks and they gain eyesight. They are mostly dependent on their great sense of smell in adult life. If a honey badger isn't in the mood to make it his own bed, it is not shy about making itself at home in someone else's residence to get comfortable, such in the dens of artworks or in the tunnel of foxes, mongooses, or spring hares. Mature male honey badgers weigh 10 to 15 kilograms, and the female are a little lighter. They rise. 25 centimeter off the ground and grow to 60 to 75 centimeter in length. Add on a bushy tail and this is not a small animal. Digging is the favorite honey badger's pastime because good way to capture prey. And honey badgers are one of Africa's cleverest creatures, capable of tricking their captors and escaping any man-made trap. Honey badgers are solitary animals that spend most of the year on their own. They join up during mating season and sometimes hang out with a partner for a month before taking their own path once more. Despite their solitary nature, honey badgers do like a lot of motherly affection. There is no definitive age at which a young girl leaves home. Some skip away as soon as they are capable of sourcing their own food. 
but other honey badgers are real mummy boys and stick around until they are bigger than their mothers. Usually they are diurnal animals, meaning they are most active during the day. But in places with lots of human, they switch and become nocturnal, thereby avoiding attention. South Africa is a great place to see honey badgers in the wild. They occupy national parks and urban pastures all the way from Cape Town to Kruger. Whenever you see a honey badger in the wild, remember that these are not mean or aggressive animals, but beautiful creatures that have been smart and strong enough to stay safe.